Adrian Posty and this is uh, Miguel from the Embargo Man channel. Okay, I'm just saying blame it on Matthew, right? You know, I couldn't, you know, post other bits in random Mick channel because, you know, it's not because it was just raining in Florida, it's because of Hurricane Matthew. Well, and for the Charles Trippy. You know, um, you know, aka CTFXTC with Ali, and you know, CTFX for a long time. I've never watched a video since, you know, the hot fucking sauce video, right? And other when you were with your other your Ali Speed, I remember. Yeah, and I and I seen some some of the things of all you know. Over there in St. Peter, or where you live in Florida, around there, Tampa Bay. I live in Miami, Florida. Here in South Florida, it rains. And then with the Sika thing and all this thing, then I'm just saying, I seen people over there in your video, Charles Trippy, about, you know, you finding fish and you find like there's a shark and you stick your shoe in the mud and stuff. Yeah, at least you have went out and went to buy pumpkins right here, over there in Tampa, for, or where you live, you know? Well, here, yeah, I haven't just given out because, you know, anyway, I don't have a car, and even though I catch the bus or something like that, yeah, you know, the trip to the metro rail and all that stuff. In random mig for folks watching you there thanks for joining in thanks for tuning in I'm just saying Matthew and when I see when they have some a lot of damage over there in North Carolina South Carolina it has a, a lot to have been, have done a lot of damage in Haiti and then like I'm gonna tell you and then the names of the hurricanes, we know that one of them called call a boy name, one of them called a girl name, you know, what is it? Okay, hurricanes are like little children, right? They're like little kids, right? A little boy, a little girl, you know. What it is, is like the hurricanes is like a little kid coming curious, you know, like, you know, you know how kid, little, you know, children are. They're like small children, you know, like. They want to wander things around, then you come, and then you let you into the room, and they go and mess around, and mess things up, and you know, there's a mess and everything like that. That's how hurricanes work. So, this is the thing about her, how hurricanes are. But then, back in 1992, even though I seen a lot of damage, a flying police car on TV and all that stuff, what the hell are you doing, a, a flying crown vic? <laughs> in the in the in the night in the her darn hurricane Andrew damn I was like saying uh, you know flying everything's flying and, and on and it has done lots of damage you know I was like uh, 13 years old when this when when this thing came by during hurricane Andrew you know it was like my mom has her blue pickup truck and everybody you know I mean, went to shelter and all that stuff, and there has been a lot of damage in Florida. Right here in Miami, right here in South Florida. You know, Hurricane Andrew has, has been a Category 5. And then I'm going to show you some footages of Hurricane Andrew. Stay tuned right there. They're coming up.
On August 23, 1992, a Force 5 hurricane struck the southern tip of Florida. The only other like it to hit the United States in the 20th century was Hurricane Camille in 1969. Hurricane Andrew's wind gusts reached 170 miles per hour, and the devastation was enormous, especially in Dade County, Florida. 90,000 homes were destroyed or damaged, and a quarter of a million were left homeless. It was the most costly storm in U.S. history. So, this is how, how strong the winds. There are 175, 180 miles per hour wind, right? You know, this is a like, very high, you know, impulse hurricane. Andrew, back in 92, you've seen the images to see how powerful it is. Damn. Those hurricanes are really tough or something, you know. Remember this Katrina? Nothing, not that much happened. You know, and everybody, when there's a hurricane season, you know, everybody goes by flashlight. They're going to go by um, batteries and generators and all that stuff. And I don't know how much money would these companies that make generators make, you know. Besides that, it's like how was like like during hurricane season, what would be for the economy? You know, what does I have been like well prepared? This is a mag light, a mag light flashlight, right? So it has been like how many like bricks and stratton selling their generators are making a lot of money. They're making millions. Honda. Well, they're making tons of millions of dollars, you know, selling their generators during hurricane season when lights are out or something like that, and then they have no power, they're going to, like, light up with the generator. So, you know, people have to calm down and stuff, you know, like, like besides, there is going to be no video games, no Xbox or anything like that, you know, what the hell is going to do, play cards? Yeah, probably. You know, other forms of entertain yourself, read read or something like that, you know. Yeah, there's other things that, during hurricane. And then there's people doing hurricane parties and stuff. I remember that. This is with later hurricanes. But, you know, but Andrew is really something, you know. I, I tell you how hurricanes, you know, hurricanes are like little children. It's like you go and let them in and they go in there and they mess around and they make messes and they mess everything up. That's how hurricanes are. Then, like, what and what Andrew has done with this little boy Andrew come there, he has messed around all all over Miami, Florida, all over South Florida. It's not just Miami, West Palm Beach, or anything like that. You know, Matthew has done a lot of damage. This buddy, this little boy has done a bunch of damage right there in Carolinas, and you know, it haven't that much, but you know. Everything was closed because I was thinking, damn, there's going to be a hurricane. It went from a Category 4 and never went to a Category 5. But but that's Matthew. Matthew never went to a Category 5. But Andrew was a Category 5. But then after that, there's, you know, after that, they're going to be his plane, maybe. Yeah, Andrew, I mean, Matthew never did came. Matthew? Matthew never like did any damage right now this year. He comes play name, playmate named Nicole. That little girl, she's gonna get ready. She's forming, you know, you know. And that's how her, that's how hurricanes are like little kid are like little children. They come, you like you send a little kid like they come around and they mess your room and they go, oh my god, like you know how you get like everything go is going to be like a mess and everything. And then, like, how you know, how many people said when they love this show, oh, I love my little hurricane. Yes, because you know how little children are. Hurricanes are like little children. Or like little children that come around and mess around in your house and stuff. But then, stay safe, everybody. You know, Charles Trippy. I like your video. Awesome video. And then I might keep watching some of the video. But that video with the hurricane, and you found, I found a shark during the Hurricane Matthew. But please tell me your story about Hurricane Andrew 
if you have lived around Andrew, I don't know if you've lived in Miami, Florida, Charles Trippy, probably, it hit Florida very bad. It hit us very bad. And for anybody who could write a comment, tell me about it, you know, get ready. And then, you know how hurricanes are. Hurricanes are like little children, you know. Matthew's like a little boy. Then you have a little girl named Nicole, you know. Goodbye, see you later, and then we'll find out. Stay tuned right here in Embargo Man. Click, uh, you know, click the subscribe button, and then right there is a link to Random Mick. You know, this is the link to the Auto Show. You know, that's the only one that I went because stay tuned in my channel. Be there or be squared. So, goodbye, everybody.